third start of the season for Trevor Rogers coming off a loss against the Cardinals Saturday in St. Louis worked around a lot of base runners first pitch on the way to Ozzy and a bouncing ball up the middle on a base hit just out of the reach of Vidal Brujan shortstop was going to his left couldn't get there that three four hopped its way through the infield all one pitch due up to Austin Riley and here it is from Trevor Rogers and a ground ball fair down the left field line. This will roll all the way into the corner. Ozzie runs out from underneath his helmet. Hits the bag at third. Windmill to the plate. They just now hit the cutoff man. One nothing brave. There's the start you're looking for. Austin Riley shooting one down the left field line just past Emmanuel Rivera, the third baseman. And he picks up his 11th RBI of the season and puts the Braves on the board. And the one-two pitch is swung on it. Missed strike three. That's a good high heater from Trevor Rogers, and it's our first strikeout tonight. Braves leading one nothing. We're in the top of the first inning as Rogers comes set the pitch. It's swung on it. Missed strike three. The Braves get a run in the first inning, but nothing further. Max Fried the last two years has actually been the best starter in the first inning in baseball. Now all of a sudden we get off to a little bit of a slow start this year. I don't think there are any real concerns here. So it's a leadoff walk. Did Bell go around? Yes, he did, says Brian O'Nora, the crew chief, down the first baseline. A good recovery after the walk from Max Reed. There's the 2-1 pitch on the way. A little poke out to short. Arce has got it. Glove toss to Ozzie. Over to first. Not in time over there. That's a dazzling play at second, though. Not easy to deliver a ball accurately when you toss with your glove, and Orlando is able to get it over there to Ozzie very quickly. And runners are at first and second with two down for Jazz Chisholm. Chisholm reaches for it, grounds it to Ozzy Albies, and that's more like Max Fried in the first inning. One nothing Atlanta. Austin Riley RBI double is the difference right now as Trevor Rogers goes back to work. One ball and two strikes to Duvall, and he got him. Looking at a fastball at the bottom of the zone, three consecutive Ks. Well, it's just a perfect pitch. There's a swing and a miss by Harris. He's down on strikes. That's four consecutive strikeouts for Trevor Rogers, and there's two outs here in the second inning. Bouncing ball towards short. That's Bruhan. Really good inning there for Trevor Rogers. One, two, three with a couple of strikeouts. Wanting to show everything, get through that first inning and kind of turn this thing around for Max Fried. Swing and a miss. Garcia goes down on the curveball from Max Fried. Here's the three two pitch again from Max. And a ground ball back to the mound off the third base side of the mound for Max. He gloves it. Throws over to Olsen and two away. Softly to Austin Riley. He's going to have to hurry. He does. Perfect strike to Matt Olson. And the second inning goes six up, six down. It's going to be 9 1 and 2 coming up with the Braves. Atlanta leading 1 0. 1 1 ground ball fair down the left field line. Carbon copy of what we saw Riley do in the first inning. Travis going to cruise into second base. And a leadoff double has set the table for the top of the order. So flip the lineup card over. And here is Ronald Acuna Jr. Looks pretty good there. Darnell had to wait for that ball to get by Bruhan, so he's at third. Back to back hits to start the inning for the Braves. And another base hit on another changeup from Trevor Rogers. So the Braves a chance to add on here. There he goes. There's a ground ball to the shortstop. Bruhan's got it. He's coming home, and they got Darno at the dish. That's a beautiful heads up play by Vidal Bruhan at shortstop. He was not going to turn two. Darno was going on contact, and Albies hit the ball so hard on the ground that Bruhan knew he had to play at the plate. Runners at first and third. The payoff pitch is over, called strike three. He just locked him up with a changeup. That was a beauty. Rodgers has punched out Olsen twice tonight. And the Marlins have themselves their second hit of the night. It's a one out single for a rise here in the third. Orlando to Ozzy to Olsen. Six, four, three, double play. The Braves got a quick run in the first and have threatened since, but no one has crossed the plate. And Arcia lines one toward the gap in right center. That'll get down and head of the wall. Orlando's got at least two, and he'll glide into second base with a stand-up double. I mean, they are scorching some balls, and that one finally found a hole. And that one finally hit the gap. And now a runner at third and two out for Ozzie, who flares one to right that might get down, and a diving effort by Chisholm in right center field comes up empty and a run scores. See, sometimes, Ben, you just can't hit it hard every time. You gotta hit it softly sometimes to get the ball to drop. Yeah, the hardest hit there was Chisholm hitting the turf. Well, he had knocked the wind out of him. He broke his belt. And a wardrobe malfunction out there, too. Matt Olson will lead it off. He has struck out twice, 
Line up. Pitch swung on, drilled deep left center field. That's got a chance. Chisholm on the run, and it is off the wall. Matt Olson will glide into second with a leadoff double, just like Arcia did last inning, and that's Matt Olson's first ever hit off Trevor Rogers, and he almost took it out. That's low, good eye, and Ozuna has reached two more times tonight. Soriano had popped out of the Marlins bullpen and went back in, but he is coming in. And Duvall pops this one up. See if there's room. There is. Rivera makes the play for the first out. Now Michael Harris, the second bouncing ball, second base, arise. Bruhan to first, double play. Soriano steps up. Arises at first with one out. Swing and a miss. Four seamer coming inside, and there is two away now. Third man in the order, Jake Berger. Soft grounder to Ozzy. Ozzy throws to first, and Freed continues to sail right along just at 72 pitches through six. Looking to take game one here in Miami. Here is Orlando Arcia. Here's a one two pitch. And he swings and smokes one deep left center field. Going back now, De La Cruz, and it's off the wall. Arcia has got another two-bagger. That is his second double of the night, and he just missed getting that one out of here. Another leadoff double for the Braves. What's that, four? Left-on-left -left matchup with the bases loaded. Two down, three-two pitch is high. Nardi walks in the third run of the game. So they are still loaded three to nothing now Atlanta and Marcelo Zuna comes up runners go three two swung on and a bullet in the left field down for a base hit Acuna will score so will Albies and it's five nothing Braves as Ozuna stays red hot here on South Beach RBIs 14 and 15 on the season for Ozuna Michael Harris the batter he's the ninth Brave to the plate here in the seventh inning. Ground ball to the right side. Berger stops it. Close. Harris beat it out. And he'll get an RBI for his effort. Six to nothing. And the Braves have batted around. Well, that'll play too for Michael again. He did a nice job keeping the at bat alive and putting the ball in play and then using the great speed to beat Bert Smith. And now the guy who started this inning, Orlando Arcia, he had a double. Orlando grounds it toward the middle. Diving stop for Bruhan, but he can't do anything with it. Another run home. Seven to nothing. Three hit night for Orlando. Another good at bat in a big spot. Give Bruhan some credit here, right? He's not going to be able to throw anybody out. When you're having a season like this, those kind of efforts right there sometimes can go by the wayside. Vintage Max Freed tonight, leaving with a seven nothing lead, responsible for the runners on first and second. Up the middle, base hit. Went with the curveball and Rivera comes through. That'll get the Marlins on the board. Jazz scores three straight hits for the Marlins. Yeah, that one just backed up. More of a flat curveball. Rivera right on it and gets the Marlins on the scoreboard. That'll be Ozuna, Duvall, and Harris for the Braves. Still Andres on the mound for the Marlins. Here it is from Andres. And Ozuna hits one hard. Deep center field. That is leaving Miami. Straight away center onto the batter's eye. Ozuna is red hot. And it's 8-1 Braves on that home run. On a night where it's not been carrying well at all, in a pitcher's ballpark, that thing was killed. He even did a little twirl at home plate. He knew it. And it will be Aaron Bummer here coming on to try to close the door. Grounder. Orlando's got it. Braves win. A stone throw from the Atlantic. The Braves sail past the Marlins in game one of this series. A five-run seventh makes it eight to one as the final. 